Can't do trippin', trippin', can't do trippin', trippin', can't do trippin', trippin', tell me some of my best days. Hello, welcome to Robert's Reader Room and Reviews. I am here to do my latest book review. These two authors collaborated together in another book. This book is like based off a main character within that book. I just want to say I've read them together and separate and I love their work. I mean, one author who was introduced to me by another author friend of hers I just love their whole clique. They support one another. And that's what it's all about. It should be about is supporting each other, even in the same field as um, writing, being an author and everything. I just want to say that, you know, these two right here to me, I'm going to name them the triple double threat. Because when they collaborate together, I mean, the book, oh, the first book they did together, I was like, wow. And this book, I was, like, torn because I was, like, oh, this one is even better than the last one. I can see their growth in their work. And I just want to say that I thoroughly enjoyed this book. And I did my Amazon review already. But I just want to say that with no further ado, I just might as well just get into it. The book I am talking about is... The Main Attraction by Angela Dell and Laban. I just want to say, first of all, ladies, please do not take offense to what I'm about to say. But if this book was in a bookstore and I walked in and it didn't have either name on it, just the name of the book, no author name, and I read this book, I would say, this man is dope. His game, his pen game is off the charts. You, I mean, wow. For you two to be two females, y'all wrote this book. Even the last book you wrote. But this one here, I can see, like, wow. As I'm reading, I'm like, if you wouldn't know nobody, you would think these was two guys written, writing this book, not two females. No offense, I'm just saying. Maine is a character that's from He Said, She Said. And this is the prequel. And this book is mainly about him. In the beginning of the book, my two, my favorite characters, well, I'm not going to say they're not my favorite character, but the two that I hated, did not like, was Keisha and Bree. They really got on my nerves. I mean, to the point I was like, okay, Keisha, wake up. Walter do not want you. He's He wants Shayla. You need to grab hold of yourself. Let it go. Move on to something or someone who wants you. And Bree was just like messy, reporting everything back to her. And I was like, oh, they need to get her out of the circle and everything. Um, And as the book went along, I was like, I could see Walter growing and, you know, he was legit as in getting out of the game. You know, he served his purpose. He got his money up and everything. He moved on. And I he fell in love with Shayla and I could see that he wanted to have his family and just go legit. And I didn't have a problem with that. The problem I had was that him and Maine were supposed to be brothers and they were. And to me, I was, like, taken back with Maine because I felt like he was selfish. He didn't think about no one but himself. And I literally began to hate this man. I I mean, it felt like I knew him, like he was a person in my real life. And I was like, catching myself, like, Robert, this is just, this is a book, okay? This is not someone that you really know in real life. But I got so involved in this book that I started feeling like I knew him and I really hated him. I started really, really hating him. But some of the things he did to Michelle and things, I was like appalled. And then he got involved with the DA and everything. I'm not going to tell the whole book because you please, you need to pick this book up. Support both authors. I'm going to tell you, you will not be disappointed. This is a true page turner. What I take from this book is that no matter how close a person is involved in your life, 
sometimes you have to evaluate and really ask yourself what is the purpose for this person being in my life because I say that when Maine was going to do what he was going to do when he thought Walter was out of town I was like oh no he ain't but he was you just have to read the book to understand what I mean by that I just want to say I give this book five stars I wish Amazon would allow me to give it 10 stars because I definitely would. I really enjoy this book. Angela Dale LaVon, you, mm. excellent job. It was fast paced. It consists of like a hundred and, I want to say 80, 90 pages. It was like, go through the chapters just so quick. Um, it's, I just want to say Keisha and Bree. I feel like comma. That's what I want. All I want to say about that. The ending. Wow. I was not ready nor prepared for the ending of this book. It was very shocking and very kind of emotional, kind of upsetting at the ending because of where everything unfolded and. Oh, I just can't say, but I just want to say I really enjoyed the book. I loved it. I give it five stars. I'm waiting to see what else y'all going to collaborate with. Triple Dual Threat. That's y'all new name, Triple Dual Threat from me. Um, I want to thank everyone who support Robert's Reading Room and Reviews. I'm also on Instagram. It's Robert's Reading Room. Um, my Facebook page is Robert's Reading Room and Reviews. I... If you want to check out other channels, please check out my literary twin, Diane Member, The Breakdown. Um, my literary brother, Jonathan Ross, Books, Beauty, and Stuff, and Strawberry Reads. Um, and I just want to say, please, pick up, one click, this book is $2.99, and you will not be disappointed. This is a page turner, The Main Attraction by Angie Liddell and LaVon. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. Until next time, bye.